so welcome back and let's continue from where we stopped so i was asking you uh, how was the experience like when you were going back to school that day of reporting and uh, that a whole week when you're in school how was the experience for me you can comment down below and tell me how was the experience but for me i used to hate that day that we're supposed to go back to school uh you're told to be at school at five so you your mom has prepared you in the morning and by 10 she has she has, she has told you like it's time to go to school but let me tell you for those people maybe who are using like town you have to be in town so that you can get a bus or a mat to go to school will still like be roaming in town and mind you we are not shop doing shopping because earlier you had done shopping for the items that you need and but you will still be roaming and let me tell you and that one maybe can comment down below and tell me you'll still get late <laughs> like if you're supposed to be in school by five o'clock imagine that five o'clock will find you maybe you're in a bus or you're in a mat heading to school so if there's something okay in my school before we changed our uh, principal you were told either you go back and um you 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 go back and bring uh you come with a parent the following day or immediately if you don't stay far they will just tell you go back tomorrow in the morning come with your parents so that they can explain why you are late so me I will, I will not even try to go back home so what i used to do is let me get the other option of doing the punishment hey kufieka like those hey hey or maybe you're told to wash the dormitory or your any any harsh punishment that you'll be given so that's it and then another something else that i used to hate when i'm in school like now we have come, it's that day homesick homesick like it used to be like wait i feel like i want to go home Okay, as in that one week was not easy at all at all that one week was never easy and um uh, something else do what do we what we used to miss like okay that 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 day that you have uh you're in school you have homesick um and i think was waking up in the morning wait maybe you are in that holiday like now as we used to close like three weeks i guess if i'm not three weeks to one month no three weeks to four weeks i guess but now i'm seeing that people are closing only two weeks and they go back no just know that the homesick will catch on them especially my cousin because he's in form one so i know those two weeks were not enough like to feel at home and then again you're back to school Wait okay um in the morning waking up and taking a cold shower that's something i hated for the last four years for the last i guess we showered with hot water when we were in form one after that that was cold water Aki, i used to wake up like you see when you go and hey hey that water right now even if you're told to take a shower even if it's hot like what I guess the only shower the only cold water that you experience is when you're swimming like but showering especially in the morning like now it's chilly mm -mm. so showering was my worst when i was in high school um of course morning preps i never used to like morning preps especially for that one week that that period of one week maybe you reported to school on monday i used to look forward to weekend because one thing we can't we don't wake up early we can't you have time to relax yes and um we're still on what i you hated most uh when reporting to school or that period of one week to adjust now to um, to the environment and mind you it's the environment that you have been so used to mm, another thing hey a book comment down below and tell me because me it's like i'm forgetting it long time since i cleared school um something else that i used to hate apart from waking up going back to school um those morning preps i never used to oh the meal remember that at home you just adjusting to like you have you, you used to like you're eating your favorite meal and then you go back 
if there's one thing I used to hate even up to now I don't like githeri and dengu especially when we are eating those two green dengus githeri hey actually I never used to like any meal when I was in school especially githeri Aki used to like you eat githeri mostly maybe you will eat githeri like three three twice no thrice a week and the rest maybe you'll have dengu with ugali rice and then <laughs> another thing <laughs> is when maybe you used to get a, a piece of meat yeah actually we, we used to be told that work hard you'll be able to go and buy your own meat or eat your own meat at home but when you're in school it's Kenny, you will queue for that one, 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 one meat, that cow, a piece of meat. Way, anyway, but either way, it was the best experience. Everyone goes there, and um, hey, another thing I used to hate before even I forgot and before I end this vlog because I never wanted it to be long. Uh, something else I used to hate is uh, like when the principal is there or the discipline master or any teacher is telling you you know what you're complaining of waking up early when you finish school you will sleep all you can hmm that's a lie imagine right now let me just tell those people who are in school maybe those who maybe there are those who will watch me before maybe the, because the schools they are going back on some place i don't know what my neighbor is doing oh no um oh my god what is he doing or what is she doing i don't know so we used to be told that when you clear school you're going to like uh you'll be sleeping the way you want let me tell those people who are going back to school when you finish school like when you graduate to when you graduate now you're done with high school coming now to campus and then after campus no from high school it's campus you think that you won't wake up early if you have a class at seven o'clock in the morning you'll have to wake up depending on where you're coming from you see you still want to wake up then after campus now when you hit the road like the real life now hey 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 i guess sometimes you wake up at four o'clock or three o'clock you're supposed to be somewhere and mind you you slept very late like in high school we used to be told can you sleep early because you have to be, you have to like your mind has to relax so that you can wake up in the morning the following day early now you slept late maybe you slept at one o'clock tomorrow at three o'clock or four o'clock you're supposed to wake up let me tell those who are in high school i used to tell my cousins who maybe graduate who 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 now are in campus and i will still keep on telling those who are in high school life is not easy here first work hard but actually your talent is taking you somewhere because for me right now it's all about my talent but either way you have to work hard in school so when you're told to study hard you don't want when you're told there was a time that you will wake up early in the morning <laughs> let me just tell you the truth you will your time is coming anyway i want to end the vlog here so that i let me continue with my breakfast i want to end it here it was just i remember i was just remembering how it used to be in school when those times when you are going back to school so maybe you can share your comments down below. Tell me how it was. How was the experience? Was it good? Was it, you know, yeah, those who the experience was good. Not all of us, especially for those who went to public school. We have a history or we have a story, but those who went to international school, I guess the experience is different. It's not like us. So uh, thank you so much. Let me end my vlog here. Till the next one, it's Spirit Manga. Please kindly don't forget to watch this video to the end. Don't forget to like, share, and above all, subscribe. So till the next one, thank you for keeping me company. Bye-bye.